Hello guys, I got some great news for some people up there who love folk. I'm gonna think I'm crazy, but the director of whatever for Frozen has officially announced they're making Frozen 2. Now, guys, this is a week that it's nighttime now, I'm really tired, so I'm not gonna go downstairs and get the news article because I can't find it on my phone. But, my mom was looking on her, um, Disney thing, because we want to go see a movie soon, blah, 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 she yells, oh my god, I come and I'm like, what's the problem, it said that fans really, really want Elsa to have a girlfriend in the Frozen 2, they want Elsa to have a girlfriend, like, for a kids movie. Kids don't need to know about that kind of stuff. Like, sure, I'm old enough to know, but some kids out there aren't. So, that's what you want to go to your parents asking, Mom, what's a lesbian girl? And then me getting in trouble, just turn the video off. Please, I don't, I don't want to get in trouble. Um, actually, uh, another surprising thing I found out was that Josh Gad is Olaf. Another one of Disney fail things. I'm going to go get back to on a lesbian thing for a sec. Just giving all the people out there a chance to turn their phone off or whatever they're watching. Um, Josh Gad plays Olaf. When Josh Gad is... He is a comedian, but he's like, kind of like Adam Sandler, like, if you've ever watched Pixels, he's the second worst guy, actually. First worst is Firebuster. Um. Yes, yeah, so now I'm going to get back to the Elsa thing. So, the people want Elsa to have a girlfriend. So, they have, they have announced that they're making a Frozen 2, but they haven't announced what's about but that's just fans really want like a kid shouldn't know about that in a kids movie for crying out loud this isn't the first time Disney has done this stuff with family or kid shows like the Muppets Disney, you suck. Muppets movie, that was okay. I didn't even know there was a Muppet show after I heard you were making a new one on ABC. I'm like, oh my god, for once the Americans are doing something good. Then I realize that you Americans make a family show look like bullshit. This is stuff for family and kids. I hope you directors are watching this. Also, come to your house and make you. You got that? I'll put a video of something in your face until you do it. I'm not going to say that something. I'm just going to say there's going to be hairs and weird spots. And you won't like it. And you'll get caught by your wife or your husband. Not to be offensive, but I'm really pissed. Of what you guys have done. Walter Disney. If I were him. I'd be turning to my grave. And I'd shoot myself six times in the head. Oh. I'd shoot my soul. Shoot myself. Oh. Yeah that's kind of it. Uh, well. I just really want to make this focus now on how scary Disney movies are and all that kind of stuff. Like, um, the BFG, which I hear you guys are making. I read that book. Yes, it was a good book. It's a family movie. And from the trailer, it does, it does look like a family movie. But you didn't have to. Put in the witch's hour and the boogeyman and all that kind of stuff. 
That stuff creeps people out. No, that creeped me out. You wanna know what else creeped me out? Finding Nemo. I'm the shark right behind you. With my smile and my big teeth that are totally don't have a few specks of blood. And the fact that in every single Disney cartoon, pigs are, you always make a parent or someone die. You get... Flounder? No. Nemo's dad's wife. Whatever. You get Arlo's dad. Papa. Um... I'm trying to think about kids' movie, which isn't really that hard. Uh, no, I don't want to say it. I don't know. You guys want? You guys? Let me say, you get the Lion King for crying out loud. The Lion King. The Lion King. Back to Frozen, the parents die. Back to Tarzan, the parents die. Actually, I'm not so sure about that because I haven't seen the movie in ages. From when it came out in whatever, blah blah, 1999 maybe. And I saw it on VHS because I have it, bitch. And then, you did it again. You guys made, oh, let's see. How about let's take a princess movie like... Oh no, I will tell you a good one, not a princess movie. Here, I think this is by Disney, I don't know. Probably not by Disney, pretty sure it's by Universal. But anyhow, whoever, Happy Feet. I was so low when that came out. I was so happy to go see it in theaters. Back then, the stuff was blasting, it still is, but I don't really know, I need... I'm too old. I need to turn up the Big Bang Theory for crying out loud. I need to turn up the part where they say, hey. They do go, hey, you right? No, I'm. And I was crying. I was off to sleep because I was so scared. My chest really hurts right now from saying this. That seal scared the shit out of me. That seal. Whatever. No, back to Disney. I think it is. Yeah, Disney Pixar. Toy Story. That baby doll thing. That's just. From Toy Story 3. That, that's just creepy. You got Sid. <laughs> and all the stuff he makes. No, that's. Okay. That creeped me out. I'm not saying that. So look, they're not, they're not coming up from one of my bitches. Yet. You know, I'm really scared after that. It's so hot. Um. Yeah, you guys. I don't think you guys know the difference between kid and adult. I really, I really don't know. Like all those superheroes mo movies, you can't just leave sex out of it for two seconds. Two bloody seconds. Sure, in Iron Man, there's only like not even one when they're just wrestling on the bed. You don't need. Let's not get into that. We're just kids. We don't need to know about that kind of stuff. That's how we learn so quickly. Actually, an outcome I think of it. I think this is maybe a parent, so they don't have to explain to their children all about this kind of stuff. Let's give them a book what's happening. Okay, uh, okay, yeah, sorry, I'm too.
check my time. Okay, so yeah. So, uh, ten minutes. Two, three, four, five, four. I think that's it. I'm going to number shot. Hello, thanks for watching. Please subscribe to May Point Shanks Man Productions. Um and um and oh my god um also Paintless Productions and Ethan Fraser. That's what Fraser people buy.